Hi friends, Menges disease is option A, impaired zinc transport, option B, impaired copper transport, option C, impaired magnesium transport, option D, impaired molybdenum transport. In the human body, copper ions are seen usually in the epithelial cells of the intestine. From the intestine, it reaches the blood vessel. Transport of copper from the intestine to blood vessels is with the help of a protein synthesized by the gene MNK. When this gene gets mutated, the copper is not transported to the bloodstream. Copper ions present in the intestinal cells eventually shed off. This MNK gene is responsible for the copper transportation and when this gene gets mutated, it results in the formation of Menges disease. The copper is attached to the intestinal cells with the help of metallothion protein. Why copper is important for human body function? Because copper is essential for the proper functioning of enzymes like cytochrome oxidase, tyrosinase and lysyl oxidase. Cytochrome oxidase is a major enzyme present in the electron transport chain and it is responsible for maintaining the temperature of the human body. Tyrosinase is responsible for the pigmentation of human body and lysyl oxidase is an important enzyme that helps in collagen cross-linking. In Menges disease, as the copper transport is inhibited, a proper functioning of these enzymes will not take place. Improper functioning of cytochrome oxidase manifests as hypothermia. As tyrosinase enzyme is not working properly, pigmentation will not take place that will lead to ivory hair. Collagen cross-linking will be affected due to the defective functioning of lysyl oxidase which leads to growth retardation, poor bone formation, brittle hair, increased tendency for aneurysm formation. Other features include seizures, cerebral and cerebellar degeneration, type of inheritance in Menges disease is X-linked recessive. Gene that is mutated in Menges disease is ATP7A gene or MNK gene. It is located in the X chromosome, XQ21. The other name for this disease are kingy hair disease or steely hair disease. There is another gene called ATP7B gene which is located in the 13th chromosome. Mutation of this gene leads to the formation of Wilson's disease. Thank you very much. Now guys, please tell me what will be the answer for this question. Yeah, that's right.